how to make $100 per day online earning passive income with cryptocurrency. This is my journey. And many of you know that I'm starting this journey. I'm really, it's really a goal for 2021 to be get to get to hundred dollars per day before the end of 2021. I think that's a conservative goal. I actually think I will hit it within about six months, maybe even three months. I don't know. Who knows? Make sure that you're subscribed to this channel, follow along and you will see exactly what's happening. Now, this is part of a playlist. If you're trying to figure out the ins and outs of exactly what I'm doing, how I'm doing it, I'm essentially investing in the bet fury platform which is not designed for investors it's designed for gamers but i'm using a player reward again this is a very unique instrument in the world of finance or you could say the world of games but i'm using the player reward system literally as an investing tool this is very unique if you like the idea of unique investment strategies make sure that you hit that subscribe button follow along on this channel i first got wind of some possible bet fury shenanigans the 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 this came to my attention inside of our crypto passive profits group this is our paid course where all of us are down there kicking butt taking name sharing strategies i'll put the link to the course in the description but if you can before i get to the shenanigans let me just tell you i've been doing really well i'm up to two hundred and nine thousand tokens and before you say hey did you move in a lot of crypto i did move in some crypto but it's bigger than that check it out yesterday at payout my payout I was at 205,000, already at 209,000, almost 4,000 tokens. So here's what's happened. I was using our strategy inside the group and I just did really well with it. I literally ran that strategy three nights in a row and woke up and my, my bankroll was growing. Now, of course, I was trying to invest the bankroll, but using this strategy, the house edge is so low that it was just I was just running well. I was doing really, really well. And that and overnight, especially, I, I just increased my mining. I increased the amount that I was wagering for mining. And overnight, I just woke up and I had like, you know, just overnight and just a few hours of sleep, I ended up with like 3,000 tokens or something crazy. Uh, it was incredible. It was actually absolutely incredible. And I've got some more I'm going to mine here because the mining, the mining discount ends today. We only have 13 hours left, 13 hours left. So I'll be I will be using that strategy and I will be mining overtime. It, it's almost unfair if you understand how the strategy works, literally, compared to everybody else. It, it gives you an advantage, which you need an advantage because this came up in the group. Someone mentioned in our Discord. Uh, so when they subscribed to our Crypto Passive Profits newsletter, all of our members, all of our friends over here, we, we have a Discord group. And inside that Discord group, they were talking about what was going on in Telegram. This is extremely helpful because it is impossible to stay up to date on everything that happens in, in crypto, all the different projects. It's, it's It can be a full-time job just following each and every one of these teams. So something happened over here in Beth Fury, and people were trying to figure out what's going on. Our dividend payouts dropped by roughly 7%, and we were diluted by 7% is what they were saying, is at least that's what we're saying in Telegram. They were, and so let's take a look at that. What, what happened here? You can kind of tell if you look at my payouts. By the way, if you want to see where I'm at, I'm up to, this is as of yesterday. Yep. I'm doing about $26. Now, the day before yesterday, I was even better at $28. What happened? What happened? What happened? And mind you, I ended up with more tokens between those two days. So what happened? It's pretty simple to explain. If you come down and take a look, go to all payouts. So if you look here, 469, 470, that's about 1 billion. 470 to 474, that's four, four and a half billion token jump. 474 to 476, roughly 2 billion. 476 to 473, that was a, a big drop there. 473 to 472, another drop. So what happened here is tokens are probably getting burned. People are unstaking them for whatever reason. Most likely, you playing with them. And that, that's the single biggest way tokens get burned. But look, 472 to 479, 472 billion to 479 billion. Holy smokes, that's a big difference. So what happened here? Well, if you take a look at what got distributed down here, 470, 474, there's a big jump here. How in the world did so many tokens get created on this day? Well, look at what got paid out. There's a pretty sizable jump in the amount of Bitcoin that got distributed. So it stands to reason that there could have been a contest coming that day. It could have been a well, whatever. Somebody was playing. And you know that because there's a sizable amount that got distributed because they essentially lost on the gaming platform. So, so And you can see that there's a bunch of tokens, a bunch of new tokens that got 
frozen. And since they're frozen by default, it's fair enough to say this probably happened uh, because somebody was playing and they ended up losing and they got tokens. However, take a look at what happens here. 472 to 494, yet there's a big drop. The single biggest reason we've dropped from we've dropped down in our earnings is because the volume in the pool is dropped. But yet there's a lot of tokens minted and it's dropped by a lot. If you take a look at that, that's point that's over 0.1 Bitcoin, basically. And so they're saying that a well has been playing on the website and all these new tokens got minted. Makes total sense, and these new tokens got staked. Twenty million tokens got staked. Um, and most likely it's a whale playing around. Now I'm okay with this. People are like, oh my goodness, the whales. And people are always like, oh no, the whales. Now, I mean, the downfall is it does dilute. You do get diluted. Don't, I mean, that's true. But if the whales playing with their tokens, that means these tokens are going to get burned. And clearly that's been happening in the past. That's probably what happened here. It's probably what happened here. So if, if someone who has a gaming mentality, they tend to get greedy. So what's probably going to happen is they're going to get greedy. Now, our daily returns have dropped significantly. I'm going to wait till after the mining thing is done, and I'll be able to figure out more where we're at. However, I'm compounding. My earnings are good. I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep growing it. Um, the the per hundred thousand dropped from seventy thousand to sixty five thousand. That's a significant decrease of at least seven seven percent. Um, but not all that is dilution. Part of that right here is the just the look three point three two three point three three point two. So there's about 0.1 Bitcoin in the pool, about a thousand, about a roughly a thousand, well, I guess it's about a $2,000 dip in the total pool. That's also why we, our payout went down a little bit. The payout is always dependent upon the dividend pool and the dividend pool comes from player volume. So if players are winning, it can drop. If it's a well, a well can move the volume uh, a fair amount. And a well's, it's not a big deal. A well, I mean, somebody won a thousand bucks, not a big deal. But they played a lot. They were probably up a good bit and they kept playing and they ended up losing. So they mined a lot of tokens. That just means there's good volume on the site. I don't see this as a negative. Now, of course, the reason I'm compounding, the reason I'm doing this is because my goals did get to $100 per day. So I'm just going to continue to compound. I'm going to mine today and I'm just going to keep going. I'll keep watching to see what's going on with the well activity. But to see a sporadic well show up, it's not a big deal. If you're on these tokenized websites, this happens from time to time. It may decrease our daily earnings. I'll do some math. We may be down to 0.2, 0.3 per day. It's hard to say. But even that number is only based off of making a new investment. Understand, when I compound, my original investment, the returns on that original investment increases because I'm, I'm able to compound dividends every single day. Here, come over here, take a look at this. So over here, let's just say that I... I put in my own money to mine these tokens and after that i stop and this is just showing basic compounding based on the the last numbers i did i'll i'll redo these numbers later this is a projection all of these additional earnings are essentially free meaning i don't put any more i didn't put any more money into mine these tokens i just kept compounding 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 over the course of a year right now i'm gonna try to get over a million tokens over a million tokens over the course of a year right now so we'll see, and I and by the way, I keep beating these numbers. Like, I'm probably going to beat this number next week. My whole goal is to catch up over here, at this projection over here, um, and I think that I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna beat it. I'm, I'm, I'm fairly certain I'll have more than two hundred and twelve thousand tokens by next week. This time on the tenth, you can come check it out. Subscribe to the channel. Follow along. Let's see what happens. But basically, the whales have been splashing around. Uh, in the Bet Fury platform, which is good. You want players. Now, people get upset. You can't keep people happy. Here's what you need to understand. People will say, oh, div dividends are down. That sucks. Oh, we got diluted. You can't, dividends cannot be high and you not get diluted. You have to understand that. When dividends are high, it means that people are playing. When people are playing, they are mining tokens. If there's one thing I don't like about the Bet Fury platform is that the tokens are too cheap to mine. They are entirely too cheap to mine. I don't really. I'm gonna. I'm gonna take advantage of this Black Friday mining event, but I don't like anything that incentivizes playing by decreasing mining because we all get diluted faster. A well comes in here, plays through the day yesterday, basically walks away with a thousand, two thousand dollars worth of Bitcoin in profit. That's all. But mines 22 million tokens 
because of the large dollar amounts worth of crypto, the large amounts of crypto they were gaming with. So people say, oh, I want the dividend pool. Oh, I don't want to get diluted. No, they go hand in hand. I actually like when the dividend pool pulls back a little bit. I mean, I always get excited. I talk about it on video. Oh, the dividend pool is high. Our earnings are high. But I know when the dividend pulls back a little bit, I know that I'm I'm getting diluted less. And in fact, because I'm compounding, uh, it's even less dilution. I, I do like when there's days because I compound every day. So I don't mind when there's a little bit of lower div pool for a few days. It just gives me a chance to feel like I'm making up ground, if that makes sense. Hey, thank you so much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. Stay tuned to my channel. I've got some good content coming up. Decentralized crypto equals freedom. This is Crypto Wealth. I'm out. All right, I'm doing it again. So here's the thing. Stick around. You got to stick around into my videos. So here's here's the secret part. I want, I'm going to be putting out a video probably before next Friday. In fact, I think I'll put it out by Wednesday of next week. And on that video, so Wednesday on the next week will be what the Wednesday by the 9th. So by December 9th, I'm going to put up a video. And on that video, I'm going to talk about, I'm not talking about base. You, you, if you follow my channel, you know, I've been talking about base protocol a lot. And it's basically because I found out about this project through a token pre-sale. I have to tell you something. Token pre-sales are, can be some of the most profitable, they're risky, but they can be some of the most profitable investments. The key is, how do you find out about a token before everyone else? How do you get access to the token before it goes public? And here's the key. When you get access to a pre-sale, you basically get a discount. So the token's going to get released at, say, a dollar. You get to buy in at 30 cents or 50 cents or 60 cents or 70 cents knowing that it's going to get released, say, roughly a dollar. I'm just using USD because it's easier to explain it that way. So when you get in on these pre-sales, it's finding the, find out about the right project, find out about a project that has the potential to go up, get access to the pre-sale tokens. That's the key. So you're, you're not going to want to miss that. I'm going to be putting out another couple of videos about it a little bit, kind of teasing it, if you will. But if you want to get access to that video, I'm going to save this video, the for our paid members in this crypto passive profits uh, course so go down to the description subscribe to that course that's going to be coming out on the that that video is going to get released to them everyone in that course on the 9th of december right now the course is only nine dollars and 99 cents once it's fully developed the price is going to be 29 dollars and 99 cents so make certain you go subscribe join us over there thank you so much for watching